The principles of design, which arrange the elements of art into a composition, as I always mentioned in the classes, the elements of art are kind of like ingredients. Just like you need good ingredients to cook a delicious meal, if you want to create an interesting artwork, you need to add different elements of art. The principles of design are like recipes; it will guide you through how to use the ingredients. So same thing in visual art. The principle of design will guide you to use the elements of art successfully. This week, we are going to learn and focus on one of the principles of design: movement. Visual movement is used by artists to direct viewers through their work, often to focal areas. Such movement can be direct along lines, shapes, and colors within the works. Swirling lines are often used to create a sense of movement or action, like this painting by Vincent Van Gogh. Pop art artists often use expressive lines to suggest visual movement of their characters. Optical art often suggests movement with dark to light values and shapes in different sizes. There are also a lot of sculptures and architectures suggest movement by using contrast and repetition. For this project, we are going to construct a collage with movement inside. A collage is a form of art made through cutting and pasting materials. First of all, you need to find some magazines or newspapers, and you also need a pair of scissors. The glue is optional. Look through them and pick a portrait you like. This portrait should be a close-up look of someone. Try to avoid using images that are too small. Cut out the negative space and only keep the positive space, meaning only keep the portrait itself. Then deconstruct the image by cutting it into pieces. You can cut it into stripes, different shapes, or a combination of both. Last but not least, reconstruct the pieces and add movements. There are many ways of doing it. You can be fully creative and rearrange those pieces into interesting ways. I will show you more example later. After that, if you have glue at home, glue the pieces down and take a photo of it. You've created a great art. If you don't have glue, you can just take a nice photo of your collage and upload to the Google Classroom. I can't wait to see your work this week.